Well, let's begin, motherfuckers. Check, check. We're good. Yeah? I think so. I tried to do the levels this time, guys, so if they're bad, yeah, it's my fault. It's your fault. So, uh, um, producer Stav. I'm on the motherfucking ones and twos. Super producer Scott Super Storch. Producer. I'm Scott Storch. Ba, ba, ba. No, that wasn't So him. I guess what everybody wants to hear about today, um, <laughs> a nice post from our <laughs> friends. Over on Reddit. Reddit. Yeah, subreddit. <laughs> Chapo Trap House subreddit. <laughs> I, uh, yeah. By, from user Hope for Myself 90. <laughs> Please stop making fun of people for being virgins, capital B. It's tough because I'm a leftist. I love this sub and I work hard to be a good person and practice good praxis. But I'm also 28 and a virgin. No. Watching no. y'all make fun of people. I don't understand why, like, you're... That has happened. You're allowed to do a little bit of blackface mm-hmm. if you're on the left. Why, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why Just people have been saying y'all and they're not, they're not from oh, the How south. about this? Look, I, yeah, I'll say... I don't say y'all, but I, I can get a... Uh, why can't I get a little tape? Let me go around and big wax lips. You want a little tape? I want big, fake, <laughs> black-ass lips. <laughs> I'll talk like a white person, big, <laughs> black <laughs> lips, you know? That makes sense. Give me a smooch here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Or no lips. Canary yellow suit. Big mm-hmm. Steve Harvey you can, suit. Uh-huh. You That's, can do that. I'm like, this is my praxis. <laughs> that is, it's <laughs> good praxis. This is how what people is know that I'm a, a giant scold, but I'm also cool like a black man. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know no. what praxis was for a long time. What is praxis? It's just is like the application pra- of practice, ideology. Yeah. So just how you live your life? Is that what praxis means? Yes, but it's like the practical application of like ideology. Gotcha, exactly. Gotcha. Yeah. So praxis would be like... I don't know, apologizing for being racist or letting black women go through the bar, yeah. big boy bu- buffet. For or like time. not not <laughs> buying a soda stream because the money goes to Israel. Israel. Right. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. So for me, every time I suck titties, that's good praxis. Yeah. Of my making or sure, making sure the big that wax political. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is political. <laughs> our, our, our it's women's pleasure. That's one of my main political ideals. Sex is political. I think that's like mm-hmm. a big mm-hmm. part of the Me Too movement. It's about being into rough trade gay sex. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's good practice. As practice. Yeah, as when practice. you get your ass blown out. Yeah. Well, we'll we'll get there because that's where this goes at, at a certain point. <laughs> Hell yes, I'm so excited. Yeah, <laughs> watching y'all make fun of people for being virgins or calling people virgins really hurts. Obviously, I'm a dude. Posting here on an alt because my normal username can be linked to me in real life. Oh no! Oh what? You oh. might get fired from your parents' house. <laughs> I think he's like, wait, like, wait, like, wait, like, well, it turns out that guy Brian who spends all his time posting on like Klingon forums about a political podcast. No. Did you know that that guy doesn't fuck? Yeah, we can't have any yeah. incels on our Star Trek. Yeah, Someone yeah, just exactly. calls his office. And he's like, um, Brian, can you get in here? Uh, you're yeah. gonna, we're gonna have to fire you because you don't get pussy. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, posting here. I'm in. In fact, I'm sure people would be ecstatic to find out you don't want to fuck kids. Well, ooh. Whoever this guy is. Uh-huh. Should, yeah. Sure. Sure. I would let the people know. Yes. yes. I just want pussy, but I can't get any. Yes. It'd be like a little Hans Christian Andersen story. Uh-huh. The pedophile that turned out to be a normal unfucking yeah. <laughs> Posting here on an alt because my normal username can be linked to me in real life. But I post here daily. Most of you have probably upvoted daily. my post at one point or another. Bro, that's the point of pride for this guy. Yeah. I, I was upvoted today. Yeah. Oh, that's I was upvoted. Mom, put all that energy guy. into getting pussy, yeah. bro. Mom, get fire up those hot pockets. <laughs> I had a good day today. We're going to celebrate by watching match games together. <laughs> Eat nine uh, hot pockets and think uh, about all the upvoting that happened to me. Less upvoting, more yeah. up dicking. But yeah, mm-hmm. I'm old. Getting hard. I'm We're a just virgin. getting a prostitute. I'm all it, and while it doesn't bother me much anymore, it's really br- bad practice <laughs> to call people virgins as an insult or make fun of them for being virgins. Incels are bad not because they are virgins, but because they blame women for their cause. Oof. No, they're bad because they're virgins. That's why <laughs> people laugh at them. <laughs> Nobody's like yeah, the butt Nick, of your the butt of your joke isn't like the extremely attractive uh-huh. you know like black guys that beat their girlfriends right, or right, wives. Right. Yeah, the yeah. problem isn't misogyny really. Uh-huh. It's you're picking on these people because they're fucking losers. Sure, misogyny is also bad, right, but there's right. plenty of people but in society that are here, yes. misogynists yeah, yeah. that also fuck way more than you do and are better. Oh, totally. Oh, well, totally. I think misogynists yeah. fuck the most. Yeah, it's like it's the guy. Maybe. Yeah. The guy that's like, you know, knocks his girlfriend around sometimes but has like an amazing body and like mm-hmm. fucks more than uh-huh. you. That's not, you can't easily make fun of him. Yeah. Because he's still, uh, even in your eyes, higher status than you are. Sure. 
Also, can't these people just go back into the shadows? Like, right. it's, can't it just be a mark of it's shame to not fuck? Like, sure, yeah. Not like an identity? Or do something and get get some pussy. Make fun of them for their shitty beliefs, not because they are virgins. Impossible. But seriously, that's all I have to say. Please think before oh. using virgin as an insult. It's oh. just a state of being. Oh, no, bro. So is racist. That's just a state yeah. of being. <laughs> there are, I mean, if you're a racist, honestly, if you're a fucking racist and you just sit in your basement and you don't interact with black people ever, that's yeah. fine. There's zero impact from that. It doesn't mean anything. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. I'm down with that. I mean, it, I, it, that is just... You're just saying if you're in your mind, don't like black as people. As long as you don't ever do anything racist to, to another person. That, so, th yeah. As long as but you know, like... If you're a child... That's not why you make fun of people. You don't make fun of people to correct some kind of social ill. You make fun sure. of people because you're sure. insecure and you yeah, want yeah, to feel yeah. better about yourself. Right, absolutely. You don't <laughs> do it. Yeah, because you remember when you could <laughs> fuck, and now, right. now that you do fuck, it's fun. Of course, I just, like, I just have a fundamental <laughs> misunderstanding of it. Of being funny. Thanks for reading. I love you all anyways. No, you don't. You don't know who any of these people are. No, it's, it's a community. A fake name. It's a community. I get where you're coming from. It's a bit bizarre attacking chuds as virgin man baby losers <laughs> while we have almost daily threads like I'm 27. I live at my parents. I'm unemployed and depressed and also I've got anxiety. Wait, what is a, <laughs> what is a chud? Because people say it all the time. It's a, like a horror movie term, right? Yeah. Some cyber, what is it? Underground dweller. Dweller, it? Yeah. yeah. Dweller, yeah. But it's humanoid. It, yeah, yeah. it describes MAGA people. I don't fucking know, dude. I don't know. That's I, what, I used to just call insult. Chris Hudson that. Yeah, because a chud. 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 Yeah. Chud. 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 Well, that makes sense. Yeah. 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 It was funny when I did it. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is what I like to. I think a lot of us, I look, for a lot of us, we still hold on to the capitalist idea of success that's been handed to us. <laughs> that we need to have money and a job fuck, and a partner and kids. I don't because I'm a socialist. <laughs> right. And all that to be seen as good. And that's not possible for a lot of us. I know that's not possible for me because I've been unemployed for years at this point. And you somehow still have a place to live and food and you get online all day to complain about not fucking and being made fun of by <laughs> your fellow friends. I mean, I don't understand how that's a flaw in the system. The if, system's if, fucked if up. Society's, well, if society's most worthless members are still housed. This guy has is just completely unproductive. It it offers not, nothing. It's he not, offers literally I, nothing. I don't know if I if he's being that kept alive by machines. <laughs> <laughs> he has an iron lung and he's on Reddit. <laughs> we, need, we need an iron pocket pussy for these right. guys. Yeah, that's what you I'm know, saying. Just pumping their cock. No, because in, in a system, if it was like in a functioning system, this guy wouldn't even have whatever amount of self-esteem he has that allows him to post this. <laughs> well, the problem with the growth of socialism in the last, like, two years is that it's become, it's gotten to the point where it's, it's grown a lot. It's physical. It's no, by but LDs, it's not people. <laughs> it's a bunch of, it's by, by mass. <laughs> by pounds, yeah. yeah. too many fat. <laughs> the same way Elvis has fucked the most out of all of us. Yeah. 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 By weight. Yeah, yeah. Elvis, <laughs> <laughs> by mass, had sex with three women. Yeah. Combined weight, 10,000 pounds. Uh, no, no, the problem is, is that people use, like, a critique of neoliberalism and then expand it to, like, every problem that they experience as yeah. a result of their shitty personality yeah, 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 yeah. and their shitty... no pussy getting loser. Yeah, you could be a loser and be like, oh, neoliberalism is getting yeah. me again, you know? Yeah, yeah Capitalism I mean, made my dick small. Mm. Yeah, know, Walmart, that's not the how... The Walton it, family. That's not how... Exactly. <laughs> that's not how it works. <laughs> But then, like, people are just basically taking this grievance with capitalism and then encompassing all their yeah, other yeah, interests yeah. into it. The problem with capitalism is that I, as a rich man, am still not technically rich. Yeah, because you can't buy that painting. You can't buy that Frank Frazetta painting for $1.7 <laughs> million. Dollars. So you're, you're broke as shit. I'm literally a fucking poor... I you're might a well live at my parents' yeah. house and never have sex. Yeah. You're a street urchin. I mean, I don't fuck, and it's because women know that I don't have enough money to buy that <laughs> Frank, Frank <laughs> Frazetta <laughs> painting. They're like, who's Frank Frazetta? I'm like, shut up, bitch. <laughs> Invented fantasy art. <laughs> you see a fucking hot naked woman stabbing a dragon in the face? Wait, where are you going? <laughs> the only kind of art I understand. It's something that makes me think of sweet guitar riff. Saxon cover art. Yeah, right, exactly. That's what I'm talking about. Floating castles. You know what I'm saying? A saber-toothed tiger with three rows of tits <laughs> and it's being ridden by a black He-Man. <laughs> black He-Man twins. And they got big juicy nipples. 
<laughs> Hell fucking Princes yes. of the universe. That's the right, brother. Them. Wait, keep reading this. Yeah. I Get w- to the I one with the... Guy. Yeah, I, yeah. Would, I okay. will. All right. He's pasting yeah. it out, man. He's Shout out to time. whoever... Uh, Sent Adam a copy of Bugs Life. <laughs> yeah, that was a nice gift. I'm yeah. looking forward to seeing it on Blu-ray finally. I, you know, I could use some gifts, guys. I use gifts too. Let's all give out our address. Let's dox ourselves. Mine is 200 Hart Street, Apartment <laughs> Two, Brooklyn, New York, one one two zero. Why did you do that? I don't give a shit. Send me stuff. Yeah, you're right. And people also found it anyways when I, they cross the reference shooting. that shooting. Yeah, well, yeah. you know what they didn't, but somebody like posted my neighbor's address, and it's like. I'll just give you my address. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, <laughs> don't harass Nick's neighbor. <laughs> Can you get this to Nick, please? Yeah. <laughs> Is it that guy that has the decal on the back of his truck that they all hate? No new friends. No new friends. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Dude. Yeah, it's sick. <laughs> yeah. Um. Okay. Sorry. I'm trying to find because keep talking while I find the the, the where this escalates. Oh, okay. Um. I don't know. This is kind of ridiculous. Just like. Try well, yeah, that's the pro. Bro. I don't know. I I feel like improve insults. yourself, brother, or just see a prostitute. I I really no, don't. I mean, look, I know it, that's it's your legitimate favorite work. Thing. All right, now you're trying to spin your sex slavery, your helping of sex slavery into being. Seriously, warped. if you're 28 years old and you're losing your fucking mind because you haven't fucked, just it's go. Not yeah, same. that's the, no. It's that's not the it's same. Not the it's same. Like, I, you want women get, to want to fuck you. You want it. You want no, to. No, no. Here's the thing. You should just go fuck a prostitute. Just go fuck a prostitute. It's not gonna be the same, but at least you wouldn't it won't be in a position where you've never fucked. Exactly. I guess that. And then your whole identity is virgin. You know. So, like, if it's, a, if it's just a it, threshold dude. where you need to fuck one time and then you can also feel like you're not this thing. Also, a good will treat you the right way and be like, you're actually pretty good at fucking. And she'll, like, uh, give that guy some confidence. Yeah, she'll make and you feel nice. it's not even about fucking more. It's about, like, get a fucking job. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Brush your teeth. Right. Mm-hmm. I didn't brush my teeth today. And I'm <laughs> a fucking millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> you know? So that's one of those capitalist ideas that's implanted in our heads. Oh, you yeah. Brush your brush teeth your every teeth. day. Mm-hmm. And use condoms. Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. Trojan is trying to sell latex. Yeah. Okay? Neoliberal. Who do you think owns the condom yeah. companies? Mm-hmm. DuPont. Mm-hmm. Okay? Mm-hmm. They're trying to fucking peddle their the chemicals. The Coke brothers. And by the way, it's not good for your dick to have latex on your dick. Yeah, What's it's latex? Bad. A chemical. Yeah. yeah. Pussy is natural, brother. I don't want pussy chemicals. Yeah. I want that natural pussy cam mm. all over my fucking hog. Yeah. <laughs> I don't need to use condoms, baby. I used to fuck black girls. <laughs> <laughs> like, what does that mean? Shut up. <laughs> Shut up, <laughs> y'all. Shut up, y'all. <laughs> yeah. What do you guys think of this for uh, having anal sex? Dipping the boss hog in the mud. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what do you think about that? That sounds like a Frank Frazetta painting. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's just Why like did a, we were it's talking just about a pig <laughs> demon yeah, wearing yeah. like a Viking cap? Yeah, that's, his, I was thinking Viking. Yeah, his dick is like a battle axe. <laughs> <laughs> He's just cutting a woman's <laughs> pussy directly <laughs> in half. <laughs> He's got fucking yeah. awesome gold tusks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dude, Frazetta, Why baby. did metal adopt that aesthetic? It rules. That's a that great that aesthetic. It's cool it's as awesome. shit. Yeah. yeah. Was it get, Zeppelin wasn't metal, but they were really into like Lord of the Rings style fantasy shit. Yeah, but they never had that aesthetic. This is more like like fucking... I know it. Like, uh, like He-Man. Yeah, like Dio. Conan. Yeah, yeah. Like guys that sang... Ah! <laughs> like that and shit. Ronnie James Dio, mm-hmm. oh, man. Ronnie James Dio. R.I.P., right? Man of yeah. War. Man of War is definitely a Man fantasy art band. Mm-hmm. Dio, yeah. yeah, yeah Jackson, yeah. like I said earlier. Yeah. Dude, that's sick, though. That's yeah. When did he, was he was Frank Frazetta active? Like in the 70s? 60s? Like 70s. 60s, early 70s. Yeah, cool. Up to the 80s. I mean, he, like, I think he died in, mm-hmm. I don't know. Could he shred guitar? Um, yeah, he invented shredding. Yeah, yeah. He, he, oh, did, cool. he, he was the first guy to have a double neck guitar. Yeah. Oh, very cool. Mm-hmm. The fucking. I love guitar. how much time that saves. You yeah. know. Oh yeah. You don't have to pick up a second guitar. <laughs> yeah. On top of being unemployed, virgin fail sons. Not that there's anything wrong with that. They waste their free time promoting capitalism and the patriarchy. Oh. So that's why. They're <sighs> that's why. I, oh God. Damn. Bro, hit the fucking gym. Yeah. Get some hobbies. I don't know, man. They should be the vanguard, but they've chosen to be traitors instead. I don't think it's traitors. wrong to point out. I mean, they should be the vanguard. So the leaders of the socialist revolution should be virgin. Yeah. There was a tweet in like Unix. 2010, and I can't remember who the fuck did it, but one of those weird Twitter guys that was like, 
in the future socialist utopia, my asthma and anxiety will exempt me for any kind of physical labor. My role will be anime appraiser. I think <laughs> it was, <laughs> it was Tony, Tony Homo. Yeah, that's that. like, and yeah, it's yeah. just wow. exactly yeah. right. Like that's that's like on par with those yeah. like Donald Trump is going to be president tweets from like 2009. Yeah, 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 so yeah. true. God damn. Yeah, yeah that's like that's a fucking crystal ball right there. Yeah. Oh fuck. He doesn't tweet anymore. He was really funny. Someone, someone's mic does that. It's one of these cords doesn't work. No, it's just, is it buzzing? No, it's just if someone. T- it might be mine. Anyway, we're good yeah. now. Sorry, stop. Well, super producer, stop on the motherfucking ones and twos. Yeah, bitch. this is the best comment right here. I think the idea that right wingers are largely incels or somehow just mad about their dick size or sex life is basically r slash nice guys material, as if sex is some sort of gift bestowed upon people. Oh, this guy's just reasonable. <laughs> Um, Where's the one where about I'm the trying, guy? I'm trying to find it because yeah. I read through this quickly. Oh, here it is. 100% agree with you. On a side note, OP, hit me up if you're in the Northwest and want to bang out an androgynous dude. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> they should, that's fuck. a go-getter. That's, right. that's someone community. trying to get some fucking yeah. dick. That's someone using their community to, mm-hmm. to, get, yeah. some, mm-hmm. to get some sex. And then oh, uh, yeah. the guy says, like exact opposite side of the states, but if not, I might have taken you up on that offer. Whoa. So I like that listening to Chapo literally turns you gay. <laughs> 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 hey man, maybe the guy is gay. Uh, I don't think he's nah, gay. Nah, gay guys would have fucked by now. Yeah, right. You just hit, hit up fucking Craigslist. Yeah, if you live around Detroit and are cool with coming to Canada, you can say hi to this trans cutie if you want, and we can hook up too. None of these people what can the see fuck? each other. Yeah, they're you just know they're doing it from their thoughts. Yeah, sight unseen, yeah. they will just fuck an you absolute have to be stranger. Ugly, right? You yeah. Have to be ugly, dude. To post on Reddit. Who agreed to fuck someone, to travel to a different state to fuck them. Who yeah. says he's never fucked, by the way. Yeah. But, I mean, it's a trans woman, so, I mean, it's like, is that even really, like, <laughs> your on. vagina? I mean, it would be like, if yeah. a guy was like, hey, can I put my dick on your pocket? <laughs> You're like, on the pocket of your jeans. I'd be like, yeah, fuck it. I don't care. Why not? You know, it's not like they're giving up the pussy so much. It's just allowing someone access to... Uh, I think that's pussy. Yeah, okay. Even though it's surger- surgical pussy. Whatever. I'm not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> ah, shame. Although there are a lot of cuties in Florida, Whoa. I'm assuming you're from there, that would definitely eagerly take you, even if you're a little bi-curious. What the fuck? Right, this, this, is, guy, this, this guy is taking a weird this guy turn. Says, or if you're in the Midwest and don't mind non-androgynous dudes, hey, if you just want to have full-blown gay <laughs> sex. <laughs> I mean, it's gay sex, but they're androgynous. Yeah. I mean, then these I people are lip liner does soften yeah, it. Can I still <laughs> fuck you if I'm not in the Northwest or the OP? Wait, so everyone, now, there, everyone now, they're kind of nice. Nice. Yeah. now they're all just having gay sex. <laughs> 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 Not that there's anything wrong with it. If this guy's gay and he Honestly, hasn't fucked. this is kind of turning heartwarming now. It's kind of sweet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is kind of sweet. This is I mean, to the his problem. completely obnoxious post yeah. has maybe resulted Might get in some fucking... Some or at least a little confidence from, like, I could fuck these people from Reddit. You know they're sexting each other now, at least. That'd be cool. I mean, I, good for them. Yeah. Wait, can you read the, the one about the por- about porn? Yeah, this one, uh, something that is considered a necessary part of life, quoted. By whom? You don't have to do what anyone else considers oh, necessary for God. you. You are the master of your own life. You say what is a necessary part <laughs> of your life and no one else. Your life is yours to enjoy. Other people can have sex themselves if they want to. You can masturbate. It's supposed to be somewhat similar to sex. You can masturbate <laughs> to pornography, too. If you have ethical qualms with consuming commercial <laughs> pornography, go for material recorded by willing people with Are no financial incentive. Kidding? Wait, okay, so we were saying this before. If you have ethical problems about watching commercial pornography, go for non-commercial pornography online, which is 100% revenge porn. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah, the, o- yeah, the only yeah. time someone's putting up amateur or like, porn uh, on porn. Or like, man fucks Turkish wife. It's like a grainy like, cell phone no, video. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> just, just like high on cot. Like yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you have ethical qualms with that too, eh, drawings? You can always <laughs> masturbate without... Oh, my God. <laughs> 
<laughs> there was no shame in making this choice. <laughs> this what's what's funny, too. It's like you were making a decision. <laughs> is that you a clearly not? This is like, that's like when like a prison punk is like, you know what? I am a girl after yeah. being raped yeah, yeah. for six months. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, hello, boys. <laughs> Guess who's, you know, like, not completely remapped. Or I love it here. Yeah. <laughs> I've met a lot of great yeah. guys. <laughs> and it's like, oh, for some reason, Diane killed herself in the shower. She wrapped a... An extension cord around her now. I thought she seemed so happy as a woman. <laughs> I, uh, oh, unfortunately, she had a moment of clarity for 30 seconds. Oh, oh, fuck. Blew her fucking brains out. Anyways, I can recommend physical exercise for the fatness and for the depression. It helped yeah, me I get mean, by each day when I had depression. I mean, that's the thing. If you're just fat as hell and you're depressed, it's like you just got to do shit. You got to get your life going the right way. I know. That's fucking. the other thing, too, is I'm kind of jealous of these guys because the thing is, is if you have real <laughs> depression like me, yeah, my, which is mine is real, mm-hmm. uh-huh. and theirs is fake. Yours is yeah. the only real one. Yeah. Yeah. I'm perfect. Yeah, yeah. There's oh, literally 100%. nothing wrong yeah, yeah. with me. Your, your depression is perfect. Uh, there's nothing to improve. There's <laughs> nothing for me to be depressed about. <laughs> well, so, you don't When I sit Frank, around and everything. You don't everything, have a Frank Frazetta plan. I don't. You're right. So, honestly, maybe you're not depressed. Yeah, another race. You sound pretty fucking Frazetta. You need four racing wheels. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do. Dude, I have once all this you money. get the Frazetta... And they think that the capitalism is the problem. Well, I proved that wrong by being incredibly rich, and I still <laughs> want to die. <laughs> <laughs> and I still don't have health insurance, so I can't talk to anyone about it. Fuck yeah, dude. Yeah. You could. You should go to therapy. Actually. Yeah, probably. probably just uh, I won't do it. I'm going to get another racing wheel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why don't you just... Maybe. <laughs> just a consultation. Yeah, yeah this is where people on the left need to conduct self-help outside of politics. Yeah, that's not just the left. That's every... What the fuck? Yeah, every yeah, single yeah. person. Yeah. Uh, hmm. I don't... I can't uh, get a job and I want to kill myself all the time. Oh, I guess I'll just sit here and quietly think about voting for Bernie Sanders. <laughs> and that'll solve it. I'll just close my eyes and imagine <laughs> some uh, light-skinned but freckled black woman with natural hair patting me on the back <laughs> and saying, thank you for your help at the soup kitchen today. <laughs> I won't do it, to be clear. I mean, I'm, I'm not, not going oh, to Oh, of course I can't. No, I have anxiety. I, I can't too much do it. You did. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't ever actually. <laughs> <laughs> and for you to, to think, to expect that of me is actually able. Yeah. You're right. I'm going to go on Twitter and yell at people for not <laughs> respecting my mental retardation. <laughs> and not including me in the M4A campaign because I'm, I'm so mentally retarded <laughs> to be able to make every decision about anything involving disabled people. In <laughs> uh, by the way, it's ab- now that I don't have a tooth and won't for a few more months, it's, it's able, able to not, not fuck to fuck me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that makes sense to me. If you're a real ally, yeah. you have to fuck this disabled man speaking yeah. into this microphone right now. Did you read the part where there were like neck beards as an ableist term? Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you could shave it. <laughs> <laughs> fucking, I'm sorry. That's how fucking fat your gobbly ass I mean, is. It's it just yeah. This is a brutal. This is a brutal threat. I was saying before is like it's it's sad that like if you're in cell, they feel like they have two options, and one is running people over with a passenger van yeah. or being like uh, calling people racist on Twitter. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. know? Oh, yeah. You can do more stuff than that. You intimacy know? and sex work aren't really mutually exclusive. That's some of the best intimacy I've ever had. Oh, the, the, hold on. That's some of the best intimacy I ever had. And I'm going to skip over a agree. couple of sentences. Uh, everyone I've ever fucked has been a sex worker. Oh, oh God damn. Oh. But, but, but let's go back to the first sentence. That's some of the best um, intimacy I've ever had. Everyone I've ever fucked has been a sex or You have nothing to compare it to. Yeah. Well, well right. Intimacy with a friend or your mother. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I guess yeah, non-sexual intimacy. intimacy. Yeah, yeah. Well, you could fuck your friend. You support a worker <laughs> while doing it, so technically it's even better than sex in a relationship. Incredible. Oh, they're a worker. Incredible. Yeah. That's true. I agree. You have to fuck... Prostitutes can <laughs> yeah. be a true lesson. <laughs> somebody goes, somebody goes uh, maybe you could fuck a sex worker, and then somebody responds, this person doesn't have any income. Hilarious. So yeah. he's too broke to fuck. So, so they have money from They get mom. money from their parents. Yeah. <laughs> they have an internet connection. Day. There's no way they don't have fucking money. Yeah. Damn. This shit sucks. Yeah. Not to be a bootstraps-ass motherfucker, but bro, sometimes just... 
Yeah. Just fucking improve yourself. You just become a podcast superstar. Exactly. Start you your own podcast. Every five and six you come across. Hey, whoa, whoa. <laughs> sevens and eights. <laughs> that was so funny how bad you got owned last night. I did not. It was. That was. Listen, shoot or shoot, baby. That was so funny. Were you trying to fuck last night? Dude, I was, wasn't dude, even trying dude, to fuck. There's like, there like nine people standing around. This girl came out to the show and stops like, we're all leaving and stuff. Puts his arm on her shoulder. He's like, it was really nice meeting you. And okay. And Lewis I immediately it. shoots like everyone a look. And then Lewis goes to me. It was so nice to meeting you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Everyone just burst out laughing. It is face. great to have the haters girl in too. your circle. I know there's a hater. I mean, hundred. That was one hundred percent. One hundred percent hater. Lewis. Dude. Lewis. Now no, your boys are always going to be haters. Yeah. Every, well, no, ideally not. But no, come what on. Are you do? That was that was such that was so funny. <laughs> I'm dude. sorry, dude. I tried to hit you up, but I got. I was you can't. Be, come on, don't be insecure about it. On Friday night, I'm I was insecure about it. I had like a night where you got to laugh at yourself. Women like that. I do. That's how you I hit that Christmas. girl up and be like, you know how? Remember how, how embarrassed I was when I touched your body <laughs> for all too of long? My fu- First of all, it was a fine amount of time. <laughs> <Did> you <laughs> motherfuckers are out of your mind. When I could there caress, there was nothing. I didn't caress this bitch. I touched her fucking shoulder for a second. Wow. Well, yeah, so you finger you sexually assaulted I guess, a woman? I fingered a stranger. I was like, <laughs> you sexually out, assaulted. Yeah. I was like, yeah. Yeah, there's more where this came from. Yeah. You fucking bitch. He was like, I wish I could be inside there. <laughs> Oh yeah, I we haven't I've, we haven't even gotten to the fact that Morgan know. Freeman yeah. is a bad boy. He Morgan Freeman, that woman. Um, wow, what was I gonna say? Yeah, whatever, man. What, did she look good? Yeah, she was cute. Using insults like that Holler just tells me. young men that even progressive. <laughs> let, me get, let me get a second shot at it, baby girl, without Lewis around. Yeah. Lewis. <laughs> it was so funny. These guys came in. They're like, yeah, like, where do we get tickets? And, like, Lewis is like, just go inside and sit down. But he's, like, assembling blunts. And he's, like, got <laughs> yeah, they don't know. He's a cup of whiskey. And he's just outside. <laughs> so it just looks like a homeless Puerto Rican person. It's just like, no, you just fucking take it. You just take whatever you want. <laughs> I'm like, Lewis, no one knows. You're the only person that knows you're a comedian. You're just an insane <laughs> person. He's a bad He man. literally was rolling a blunt. He, was, he just had weed on a barrel, that weird barrel in the standing room. <laughs> oh, fuck. <clears throat> yeah, using uh, insults like that just tells young men that even progressive or leftist people judge them by the same standards that conservatives and chauvinists do. Just that the latter two groups are honest about it. You can't insult a guy's masculinity and then wonder why those guys are driven into the arms of red pillars and trad cops. Oh, hilarious. Look, your options are either be made fun of or not hear the people making fun of you. I mean, it's not, no, there's never going to be any kind of like revolution where. Yeah, you're going to feel good be cool. about your situation. The answer is always right. then you become fuckable. Yeah, which isn't going to happen either. Just be ashamed of the fact that you can't fuck. Right. Right. Just, just don't use it as an identity. It's like having a micro penis. Don't say I'm a proud micro penis yeah, man. Yeah. And like it's, you do it's the Holocaust. capitalism's fault. <laughs> yeah, 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 you do yeah, the Holocaust yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I like that people like fucking try to make fun of Hitler for having a micro penis. It's like he almost took over the world. <laughs> yeah, and he, he almost won. Yeah. He almost took over it the was, fucking yeah, world. It was fucking close. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mad um, respect. For mad respect guy. for Dolph. God, dude. It's what Dolph, is, but it's Hitler. That's he Hitler. Didn't even <laughs> have, he didn't even have a half inch. And he almost fucking did it. Imagine what he would do with a big ass dick, dude. He probably would have won. He probably would have continued would've. at art school. He would have fucked in art school and been a terrible artist. And That's people would have been like, Yeah, drunk. Oh my God, your paintings are so good, baby. <laughs> <laughs> like, he would have been one of those guys. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be like, Your mustache is so cool. Yeah. <laughs> There'd be a million people with Hitler mustache. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Hitler clit tickler. Yeah. That's what they'd call it. Mm-hmm. Michael yeah, Jordan is the only person brave enough to try it again. Yeah. After World War II. About the Holocaust? <laughs> Yeah, the, yeah, Israel's <laughs> been brave enough to try it. No, no, no. The uh, the must. They're in beta testing yeah. right now. <laughs> yeah. Um, <clears throat> do we have more of this thread? Yeah, being cool, sexually active, and well-adjusted is definitely seen as the ideal in a lot of leftist spaces. Like if That's you have the, the right idea. politics. What the man. fuck, dude? It it's has nothing to do with the left. Right. Why does everything <laughs> involve the left? You Shouldn't you want to be the fucking best version of yourself that you could be? Mm-hmm. You're a fucking loser right now. Change some shit about yourself. 100%. What the fuck? Get to be fat and bald and toothless. Cool. Be a cool guy like that. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You guys get it. <laughs> 
I don't know, man. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Politics doesn't really come into it when you're at a bar and have to attract people through charisma. Sex is weird and illogical. Nope, makes it's pretty obvious. Yeah, there's very there's pretty basic ass rules. Yeah, Yeah, you you go into a bar and then through the cheese that's still left in your teeth, you loudly (laughs) announce, "I voted for Bernie Sanders." (laughs) And if the women don't fuck you, well, it doesn't make them bad people. They're just not educated yet. (laughs) <laughs> giving out pamphlets about why you should fuck me. Yeah. Oh. Point out that the small dicks thing was pushed by white supremacists who wanted to argue that black guys were big, dumb, dumb sex machines. Oh. oh this is awesome. Yeah. So, so which like, is like sort of a white supremacist argument, which is like it's cool to have a small dick, actually. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's, that's, they're sort it's of not still making cool. the same argument. No, it's not cool to not fuck, and it's not cool to have a small dick. Yeah. And you should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah. But also, you don't, your dick doesn't even have to be that yeah. big. It doesn't really have no, to be that I'm, big. I'm pretty no. sure a lot of the small... Micro dick guys fuck. Micro, well, I don't know about micro dicks. That's they still do. You know, look, a, small, a small dick will never prevent you from fucking. It'll just prevent you from fucking well. Yeah. You can always The fuck. girl's not going to come. Right. Well, listen, you get some nice angles, you learn some stuff about your body, you get a... You learn uh, how to eat pussy good. You learn how to eat pussy, you yeah. make that part of your comedic identity. Yeah, you yeah. make that your whole thing, <laughs> about how you're the pussy eating guy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you figure it out. You knock a tooth out so you can lick clits better. I've really been trying gap. to not make fun of Chinese people on stage, and like the last three shows I did, there's just Chinese people there. <laughs> and I can't help myself. They just say something, or they look at me in a certain mm-hmm. way. Uh-huh. They're there. They're to, yeah, and that's the best part of my set. A hundred percent. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> huge uproarious laughter yeah, yeah, whenever yeah. you fucking hold your eyes back. Real, yeah, real. yeah, yeah. And he <laughs> took out some uh, tape and taped his eyes back last night. You did it on stage? He had, he yeah. Had, he had a gong. Oh, I'm I thought you were just doing it. it. No, no, I'm trying all new sorts of things. <laughs> you're you're trying to, like, redefine <laughs> what stand-up yeah. can do. A kimono and one of those fucking oh, conical man. patty hats. Uh, yeah, rice patty <laughs> hat. Filled the entire club with incense. <laughs> <laughs> it smelled like jasmine eucalyptus 30 minutes before my set. And I was like, what is this? <laughs> and then I you could come out and then, like, quickly fanning myself. Bang, <laughs> bang, <laughs> bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Bang. Nobody so. fuck me. <laughs> I'm Why nobody fuck me? When I did my whole. Why nobody? <laughs> Why nobody fuck me? <laughs> the, the Chinese incel. <laughs> Just me dressed as the geisha. <laughs> 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 Why not <laughs> thank me? <laughs> Eight minutes set. Uh, just fucking handing out egg rolls to the crowd. Yeah. I'm pretty sure a lot of the small big dick thing is just a complicated and fucked up sexuality developed by racist guys. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's racist guys. <laughs> <laughs> and it's spread into the culture and it's just supremely toxic anywhere it exists. It's spread with in prison the... rape jokes, for instance. How yeah, is exactly it racist to say that big dicks are good when black people have big dicks? In fact, it's. Reverse racist. The only, no, it's like it, saying white people are worse. The implication is that black people are like sex crazy. Only, oh, yeah, yeah, only yeah, yeah. Okay, I got it. Only yeah, good yeah. for their dicks. Virginity is a myth. <laughs> Hell yeah. It's a social construct. Mm-hmm. Here's what we do. Yeah, me as a virgin. When I lose my virginity, I'll totally, I'll be totally a different person with a different outlook on life because of reasons. Me as a non-virgin, literally nothing has changed. Well... I'm pretty sure this person You're down $100. That's yeah, just one thing that's going to change. It's going to take you longer to pre-order the new uh, Call of Duty. Yeah. What if we started, like, a non-profit that, like, well, we suck off all the guys? No, we got, like, we paid porn stars, like, $500,000 for one night. You have sex with, like, a thousand incels. That's good. You just knock them out, you know? Yes, the come, the come town gangbang, the incel gangbang. They'd, like, we'd pay them handsomely. Mm-hmm. We'd let them, we'd let them get their nuts. Finally, they Absolutely. feel good about themselves. And since it's a line, it's a long line. They can talk about Naruto or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, oh, they can bond. About, yeah, they can yeah. bond. They can yeah. be friends. That'd be nice. Yeah, yeah exactly. Start a community there. No condoms, of course. Fluid bonding. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's fluid bonding. No one has any STDs. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so yeah, none of them are fun. You get all hit it raw. Whoa, wrong. that's true. Yeah, Everyone gets true. to hit it raw. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's cool. <laughs> that's really cool. <laughs> I love this idea. I have a legitimate question, though. Cause somebody, is, somebody just writes, this is the gayest thing that's happened on this sub. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's absolutely correct. <laughs> this is even gayer than the Amber is a cop bullshit. <laughs> they said Amber was a cop? Yeah. For what? I don't know. For not letting retarded people 
choose what medicine gets given out to the poor. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All of the medicine should go in my wheelchair, and then I should be pushed to door to door, handing it out <laughs> so people can thank me directly. <laughs> An autistic person that just likes the way the chair feels. <laughs> I'm completely used to my life. I, <laughs> I, I love that gliding motion. Uh, I want to feel like a train. <laughs> <laughs> so I used to, the wheelchair. I put my conductor hat on. <laughs> I go around in my train themed wheelchair. I remember bossing I people my... around for socialism. I remember Chapo had like one of their old episodes, which was super funny, was that they did that Adam Sandler 9 11 movie. And the whole episode, they called him 9 11 retard. Hell yeah. And it's like, I don't understand. Have these people. Listen to that? Do probably they know? Not. No, because it's just like it's they probably cool. listen big listen in the last like three months, yeah, probably, yeah, yeah. and then they want to make it all about their whatever right, their exactly. practices. Exactly. Is or, which is not fucking, not getting pussy apparently. Yeah. That's Calling Trump supporters fat or saying Trump is a small oh, dick promote the culture yes. of alienation and insecurity hell that we yes. are fighting against. <laughs> <laughs> you are basically saying. I have a little no. ass dick and I'm fat as uh, shit. Hey, just checking in. I look like Bob's big boy with a Greek statue penis. <laughs> and ev- everyone should accept me. Some for of those penises are, you know, pretty nice and delicate, you know. Yeah, I, I love those penises you know, so small. My favorite thing about the Greek statues is the way the pubes look. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they look like billowy. Like, yeah, right. And billowy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always wish I had pubes like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish I had beautiful cool ass pubes. It's like right. a baby with curly hair. My, That's my, my, my pubic hair, it looks like a... Uh, the, well, I guess it's just gonna be racist, but you know, like a <laughs> like a forty seven year old crack addict, yeah, just yeah, hanging yeah. outside the bodega, sure, yeah, like those ain't my cigarettes, you know, like that. Just their, <laughs> There's a bird's nest mass, in there, yeah. Yeah. inconsistent density, yeah, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. I recently uh, uh, this is great. got a streamer and stuff, and man, yeah, great. we really need yeah, to stop great. mentioning the fact that Ben Shapiro is five four. Hell yes. First of all, not even making fun of him. We need to stop mentioning. Don't mention. Don't even mention it. It shouldn't be mentioned. Don't even mention it. Because some of us are little ass dick motherfuckers as well. Yeah. Can I still say I'm going to pick him up and smash him against my skull like an empty beer can? Never been in a fight once in their life. Never. (laughs) Never. I'm not going to laugh if you do that. (laughs) They said that? Yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah. This shit sucks, dude. Yeah. This is um, some true little dickery at its fucking finest. Yeah, I'm still a virgin, too, because I'm lazy. But making fun of his cells like that is fine to me because it's all about how much value you put in it. Mm, yes, he doesn't care. I think that's, that's fine. Thing. I think that's... A, honestly... This guy goes, uh, yeah, I'm old, though. And the guy says, dude, 28 is not old. I'm sorry for not having fucked 28 is old. Can you imagine being no. 28 no. years that old? That would suck. That was last year I, for me. I really said... Oh, that. my God. Yeah. So I think the guy does not fuck <laughs> up until a year ago. Oh. It sucks, dude. Before I fucked, I was like an insane person. I was like, well, you're always worried about it. I can't imagine you're that terrified. compounding. You're scared. You're like, every year it you sucks. don't fuck... By 28, 29, your thing should you should have had so many failed relationships that your problem is like you don't want to fuck I'll anymore. never yeah. love anyone. Right? Yes. Like that's the that that's unfortunately that is that's the, the kind of like you know, <laughs> that's the kind of like existential problem you should have. It's not like because that what was just pussy feel at like? thirty years old. <laughs> right. <laughs> at thirty Wondering years old, what it feels like when you're you have no pussy. experience with relationships. Right. That's the fucking problem. All your grandparents. You are gonna are die even if you do fuck. You're gonna die alone because you're gonna like the first relationship you have. You're gonna be insanely uh-huh. jealous and uh-huh. fucking paranoid and doting and like all this. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, and everything's gonna be real for the first time. Yeah, and it's yeah, gonna yeah. Feel the most intense that it ever <laughs> feels. And then you're gonna try to keep recreating <laughs> it the rest of your life, but yeah, it'll yeah. never feel the same way. Dude, imagine going to your 10 year high school anniversary <laughs> reunion and being like, "So what does pussy feel like, guys?" Yeah. <laughs> well, considering like considering his 10 year high school reunion probably takes place in the living room of his own house with his parents <laughs> and yeah. his brother, who also doesn't fuck. <laughs> Oh, my God. Yeah. I love, too, that he would go to a, or a high school reunion and be like, what does pussy feel like? <laughs> uh, they said I could ask on the Chapo subreddit. <laughs> it's I just it. think, like, it makes sense that these people are, like, like either posting obnoxious shit like this or, like, doing terrorism. Yeah. Like, because you're yeah, literally yeah, yeah. a psychopath. Yeah, it's true. Somebody but wrote, there are somebody wrote, simple, proactive measures that they can take towards fuss. Somebody wrote, have you tried sucking your own dick? <laughs> 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 Including sucking your own dick. Hell yeah, Which dude. is physically impossible for this person, I can assure you. Probably, yeah. And most people, to be honest. But, um... Not for me. 
I have a huge ass fucking dick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, I started using those little dick rings, by the way. Yeah. I put, I a put cock ring? The cock a vibrating ring. cock ring? I stretch my skin yeah. out. I started my little Oh, the, for the dickhead? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, yeah, yeah it yeah. stretches your foreskin out. It's so. like a gauge for an earring. Like a... Yes, exactly. Yeah, yeah, okay. Exactly. Have you started using those yet? I just said that, motherfucker. I, I Look right. on your listening skills. I'm man. sorry. I'm trying to find his content on the chat. All, right, all right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're right. Keep reading about... Losers that don't fuck. Yeah. Um, I've been using... Uh, Instead of non-losers like me that only fuck sometimes. <laughs> um, I mean, that is only fucking sometimes. What's the other option? Constantly, fu- always fucking? Yeah. I mean, they are right. Like, in my times in my life when internally I've been, like, the least fuckable. Like, mm-hmm. if I look at myself in the mirror, it's like, I don't... Why would you do this? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. You're the most fuckable. Oh, sure, yeah. Uh, what do you mean? Like when I was like living in a box and I was dying. You were like fucking typhoid. there. Yeah, I was fucking. Yeah, like, yeah. And you were fat a, a little bit. No, I had a paunch. He wasn't fat. I was he actually whiter than I am now. Yeah. But you had a, a belly. He had a horrible like yeah. disease body. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like he had like fucking. You were fucking. Like, fucking girls I looked like on I, I looked like a prospect. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. You know, 100%. like I had like left out to die. Right. That I went searching for gold and lost my mind. Yeah, you had that horrible beard. You always wear a little fucking cap everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Fisherman's cap. Yeah. Oh, you look bad, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um. But uh, then again, he, this is my question. I, I I do think this is true. I think it's easier probably to fuck when you're in a city. If you're in oh, a small ass quoted, place, somebody and quoted like, you, Adam. What? Uh, the the tweet of yours that says I love blaming things on late capitalism instead of my terrible personality. <laughs> <laughs> I I said that. Congratulations, basically man. earlier. Yeah, yeah I mean, it was it funny was when I said that prior, probably a month prior to that, before you. Oh, tweeted fuck it. off. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody reached out to me and they're like, yeah, Adam said something on the last one about, like, people on the train trying to look like Bob Dylan. And they're like, I'm pretty sure you said that word for word a month prior. I don't remember that, but I'll agree with him. <laughs> you did not say that. I don't remember saying it, but, but look, the, I mean, what, would the person be lying? Would you lie to me about that? That's literally, kinda, you're accusing this person of lying? That's fucked up. You don't even that, know that tattletale that yeah. went to yeah, Nick yeah, to tattle. Yeah, yeah. yeah. God. Yeah, still, I think he's. I think he's a real truthful guy. <laughs> I mean, it still is so <laughs> funny. This is though. The best response. LMAO, get a load of this virgin over here. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's this sort of shame that makes men explode with rage and use another tool of masculinity: gratuitous violence to show that they're oh. mature and viral That's and not losers. Oh. We're making the incel thing worse with this talk. So first of all, you'll never explode up. with gratuitous violence. You'll get Xbox and play Battlefield. Yeah. <laughs> or run people over with a van. Yeah, they won't or Elliot Rogers no. people. Elliot Rogers barely killed. He was a pussy. He had a knife, right? He got six people. Was it a gun or a knife? A I thought he stabbed fat. people. He's a, that he did literally nothing. <laughs> yeah. He's a coward. <laughs> He's a fag. <laughs> 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 I remember uh, Michael Foodie showed me the Elliot Rogers video on uh, yeah. r slash cringe like two days it's before. So funny he how much he looks really? like Shelby yeah, and he, and he felt like terrible oh afterwards. Oh my yeah, god, yeah. that's brutal. Because everyone's like, look at this fucking loser who can't fuck, and then like he went on a street <laughs> yeah. murder. Six yeah, 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 people. Yeah. Awful. Virginity truly doesn't matter, my friend. I may use it as an insult because it works well against the right who idolize power and control over women. Know that it's absurd to actually think less of anyone for not having sex. I'm sorry, but this is like the same argument that, like, uh, uh, yeah, of course I make fun of virgins all the time, but it's to hurt the ones that don't. Like, if I, like, yeah, yeah. I say the N-word exactly. constantly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, whatever, dude. Fuck these people. Who cares? Well, I care. It's is giving us more? pretty good content. It is, I know, <laughs> but I'm tired of it. Yeah, I'm exhausted a little bit, but... Um, oh, I ate a breakfast burrito. I'm trying intermittent fasting, you know? Yeah. Good, dude. You said it. That's, you said yeah. an Apple. I'm going to get you an Apple watch. Ooh. You Can I say it. something? <laughs> Can I say something? You set a timer on the watch, and then once you start eating, you just call I, it. Yeah. I, it's hard to hit the same six-hour window for me every day, uh-huh. so I just, once I start eating, I... Yeah, that's what I do, too. Yeah. Can I Can I say something on the show? Bring the vibe down, but 
Can we just oh, yeah. say something about Dylan? Dylan? Yeah. yeah, of course. Of course. Uh, I think Dylan like, Meyer, I think I already posted Really that. good guy and, like, really happy-go-lucky, really funny guy. Like always. I can't really speak to his personality. I don't know him that well. He, he could really, have been a piece of shit. No, no, he was a fucking, I know. No, he was a good guy, he was a dude. Great yeah, yeah. Dude. I hung out with him a couple times. He was a fun guy to hang out with. But, uh, like, I, I remember saying yeah. uh, he, he was my favorite comic in D.C. And You said it on you, the show. One of you argued with me about it. Uh, it was probably Stop. It was Stop, bro. Yeah, Stop. Stop. Why are you? What the? F- I just Stop said he was Stop one of the worst. Stop said he's terrible. Was terrible. I hope he dies. I never, I never. Stop said I hope he dies. <laughs> and then he touched that girl's arm for way too long. He said I really hope my friend Dylan dies, and I need your the, the, your need warm your, your warm touch. It's your really warm shitty. pussy touch on my sad dick. It's <laughs> sad about my friend dying. <laughs> um, it's really he was a fucking great comic. Yeah, yeah, he was Dylan a great McCoy. comic and a good guy. And it's it's, Dylan it's, it's that a big loss. I saw him do a bit one time about a making a woman come is like giving a drunk person a ride home. <laughs> and they're like, you're like, I'm I'm drunk too. So like, where they're like, just a couple more blocks, just keep going. They're like, all right, well, like, is it, is it much longer? Like, how much? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like, just go a couple more blocks, and it's like, look, I'm. I'm pretty drunk myself, so <laughs> you know, like, well, just go a couple more blocks. Like, okay, well, this is my house. We're already here. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Yeah, it's a great joke. Um, yeah, it fucking sucks, dude. It really sucks, and just our thoughts are with his family and everyone in DC. Oh, where we up, all started. Dude. No, man, it's not bad. The guy fucking died at whatever. Shut up, man. Yeah. Thoughts. Yeah, yes, it's okay to... You it's know. okay you to don't, fucking You can say walk the line shit. between... No, no, you can be a real human being no. and show emotion. No, Every once when, when someone, tra- when our friend tragically dies, it's okay Suddenly. To, yeah. 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 Completely out of nowhere. We should mention that he was found by our friend with a, stu- Donnie, with a stutter, which makes it... That yeah. does take the edge off a little bit. Poor it Donnie. Was, it was weird. It was, yeah. He was stutter. Yeah. I got the call from He was stutter. This stuff. I got bad news. Poor kid. You got to find him, though, too. Where's that fixed his stutter, though? Yeah, you know what? At first, he wasn't stuttering, so I was like, yeah, maybe. Maybe. It's like getting the hiccups scared out of you. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> a g- 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 ghost. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh man. But this is fuck. Yeah, this sucks. So yeah. So, it just reminds Love you to that. Donnie. It just reminds you that the world sucks, Dick. And, and it reminds you that you can say. go at any moment. So you better not die an unfuckable loser trying to convince other <laughs> yeah. people in the Chapo subreddit to not call you a virgin. Yeah. And fucked. the cool thing about Dylan and what he will always be remembered for is how much he fucked and all the pussy he got. Uh-huh. He did <laughs> fuck. He did fuck. And he yeah, did, he did, did pussy. Fuck. Yeah, 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 he did. Salute to a true pussy-getting soldier. Um... Eating ass and I think it should be said that uh, it was uh, bad coke, fentanyl is coke, and well, I we think don't know fen- you don't know, know that fentanyl. Fact, but I think that a lot of people get fucked up on fentanyl and have a good ass time. You should just be heroin. careful. You're out there doing fentanyl. Godspeed to you. I don't know that's what you're at the exactly. new frontier of drug use. I think, I but I respect was, anyone no. that manufactures and sells fentanyl as if it's other drugs. But yeah, don't um, just be careful, <laughs> yeah. guys. If you're out there, be sober like me now. Yeah, yeah. Stav is sober now. Nick is sober now. Yeah, I got really drunk the other night, but I'm sober. I've been sober <laughs> since then. This, this is good. And what exactly is the difference between a virgin and being someone who used a drunken stranger as a masturbation device four Ugh. or five times in their lives after a sad <laughs> party on a Friday night? Boo. You don't post gay shit right. like this. Right. That's, That's different. This guy just imagining how sex happens. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The yeah, only party. sex is rape. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only kind of sex yeah, there the is. the difference? You're at a big frat party. Yeah, it's a big cool party. Everyone's having jello All shots. the popular <laughs> kids <laughs> with <laughs> limos with the pool in the yeah. back. <laughs> You're having sex in a gym. All the Man women are roofied there. <laughs> the best sex, in my experience, is with someone you know and care about. Oh as corny as that God. may sound, ding, 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 it's true for most people. Being a virgin is hardly sat. No, dude, the best kind of sex, both mm-hmm. drunk, don't know her name, <laughs> yep. you know, barely hard. Mm-hmm. You're bath- outside. Bathroom. Your mom's knocking the on the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember that. <laughs> oh, that was so funny, dude. <laughs> oh, that was you. I miss drunk Nick. <laughs> drunk ass Some Nick. poor fucking idiot that think Nick's is, thought Nick was famous because he had a lot of Twitter followers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, no, that girl like came to, yeah, came to a show. I don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> that girl told me, she's like, I can't get pregnant because I have PCOS. And I was like, all right, that sounds about right. And then, like, I talked to her, like, two months later. She's like, yeah, I'm having a period for, like, three months. 
And then she like had a miscarriage. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, man. Hilarious. She's one of those girls, too, that's like, I wrote a poem about you. Oh, you ever have one no. of those? It's always like the most fucked up women that have to write a poem about Good. you after you fucked them. Oh, yeah, man. that's tough. Yeah. Yikes. No, they are. It's all. It's they're just always yeah. like just fucked in the head. Oh, mm-hmm. like look at this essay I wrote about you. I'm like, I don't want to. I, yeah, it's yeah, disgusting. Yeah. To be. I mean, to <laughs> fuck you at the time also is not. A yeah, good. to fuck me at any time, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You had right. to have an emotionally distant father that you're still trying to win over. Yeah, that's yeah. That's what. That's what it is. I like they blame everything on daddy issues, and it's like sometimes it's just the girl's fault. <laughs> <laughs> No, I mean, really. I'm supposed to believe there's that many bad fathers out there? I think so. I think pretty much every father is a bad father. No, no, no. I'm going to be a great father. <laughs> oh, you my God. So? I'm gonna if you had a fucking kid, that would I'm be gonna I think it's impossible I'm to I'm going to tell my father. daughter, I'm like, look, you do any kind of fucking you want. Don't blame it on me, because I will beat the <laughs> shit out of you. If I find out. You're going to be one of I those will, cool dads. I will put cigarettes out on your, on your bottom eyelids. So I'll pull them out and fucking dip them in there like an ashtray. I'm uh. just calling protective services every day <laughs> if you have a child. I'm like, look, nothing yet, but just keep the knives sharp on this. Mm. Keep the mullen the file Christ. open. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wearing a wire at your daughter's birthday party. <laughs> <laughs> Were those men ever really going to be on the left anyways? I know there's other gems in here. The Ben Shapiro stuff is pretty good. Yeah. This is the gayest shit I've ever read, and trust me, buddy, I've read some gay shit. <laughs> <L-A-O>. <laughs> better, best, best t- better title for this supposed to be My Personal N-Word. Fuck a hooker, that's what they're there for. That's funny. Yeah. Stop being such a pussy. <laughs> I think we've pretty Shut much covered it. You know. oh, unless you want to broach another subject. Yeah, Morgan Freeman, it. what did he do? Yeah, Morgan Freeman is Dole is all, going to jail. Yeah, is she going, going to jail? Yeah. Why? Well, she, I mean, she's been like arraigned, I'm assuming. She hasn't been she's gone to trial. For what? Pretending to be black? <laughs> yeah. No, for welfare fraud. It's in the, uh, yeah, uh. Judge Mathis's court. She's going <laughs> to jail. Yeah. <laughs> I used to be white, and now I'm a judge. <laughs> judge Mathis, go Mathis, Judge Mathis. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the court, the Judge Mathis dancers. <laughs> go Mathis, go Mathis. <laughs> it's black women with, like, wearing spandex, but then the nipples are cut out, and they've got, like, Janet Jackson nipple rings on, just, you know, popping and locking it in the courtroom. Now bring me... My cup of justice. <laughs> it's like a chalice filled with grape soda. You <laughs> <laughs> sips from it. And may you, yeah, uh, uh, I, de- cup, I yeah. decree that you owe the defendant <laughs> <laughs> a, a ducketry to the sum to the tune of twenty thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Go mad this. Uh-huh. It's your birthday. <laughs> Go mad. <laughs> Hell yeah. In the courtroom. <laughs> exactly. well, so she did welfare fraud though? It's pretty hilarious. Yeah. Yo, one of my favorite videos of all time is that one of ODB going to pick up food stamps in a limo. Do you remember that? <laughs> oh, that rules. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I just saw a video on Twitter of uh Oh, now it's doing that buzzing shit. It is you every it's time. my phone. When you put your phone on the cord, it fucks it up. Sorry. Um, uh, I saw a video of a little dog eating a big dog's ass, and then that's <laughs> you, cool. and then and then and then the dog comes out of the other dog's ass and just immediately throws <laughs> up everywhere. Oh god! <laughs> it fucking rocks, dude. That was probably the best video I've seen in a while. Oh man. How about you guys? See any good internet videos? I saw that one today of that that kid's oh, yeah. whose dad was playing music via Bluetooth on the on his car speakers, and then the the car the the what do you call it the display said uh, it was his what his dad was watching on on Pornhub, and it said uh, Granny was it like fuck Granny till she squirts yeah fuck Granny <laughs> till she squirts. <laughs> <laughs> and, then <he> just <laughs> and then the video just shows like a Andre Steakhouse type guy. Uh, you know what's cool though that he's 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 beating off the age appropriate porn on his phone because he's yeah. an old man and he's watching an old lady get fucked. Yeah, that is that is appropriate. That That's is pretty nice. nice. Yeah, you don't want these old perverts him. beating off to nineteen year olds. Have you? Do you guys ever see your dad's uh, consuming pornography? Yeah. No, really? Yeah, I, did. I walked on my dad beating off one time. <laughs> yeah, <it was> cool. 
<laughs> did you see the porn? Did you see his He dick? was in bed beating off, and then I, like, opened the door, and he, like, rolled over real quick, and neither of us wanted to admit what yeah, had happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... Yeah. I just like spoke into his exposed asshole. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, what happened. Oh, what the f- oh, so he was just in bed, not covered. No, <laughs> he just rolled over real quick, and then his ass was facing me. <laughs> That's Holy literally. Holy fuck! That'd I'd be incredible. like, "Are you giving me a ride to school today?" He's like, "Yeah, I'll be down in ten minutes." <laughs> <laughs> That's literally what happened when my mom caught me. Yeah. I didn't realize he saw his ass. Yeah, his ass. Is, and because he rolled over quick, it was like his one of the, the in, inside corner ass sheet caught the bed sheet. So it, was, it opened his ass. <laughs> <laughs> you talk to your dad's ass. Oh, fuck. Yeah. yeah. You caught your dad being off? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's hilarious. I yeah, he know. yelled at me. Oh, like, it was nice. my fault. With his hard dick out? He's just well, he was, like, hard. at his desk, and so, like, the computer was facing him. Uh, so I walked in, and he was like, what the fuck are you doing? Away? <laughs> I remember finding my dad's porn on the computer, because he, like, saved it to the desk. I like, found some porn on my dad's computer. Too, yeah. awesome. And it was, like, just weird. It wasn't, like, it was just still images, because this was, like, right. probably, like, 1999 uh-huh. or 98 mm-hmm. or 99 mm-hmm. or something. And, uh, yeah, just, like, a naked woman. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, George, my friend George, caught his dad Googling girl bikini. <laughs> like, when he first got a phone. Well, your dad's, his dad's also, like, a Greek. Also a Greek, Greek man. Yeah. the worst guy that showed up. Unbelievable. That, <laughs> that was so funny. His dad is so nice. George's dad? He's got mad snacks on deck. Oh, yeah, dude. That's the best house to just go. We just chilled for, like, yeah, a yeah. hours between our show. That was awesome. He's great. His house is like a, the best green room of all time. Snacks. This is the best uh, response. Why are you airing this in a public forum and trying to get everyone to cater to you instead of just being a normal person and dealing with it on your own? Yeah. That's Which like applies it. to everything that these people are talking about. That's basically it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Except like getting health care for everyone. Fine. We can all agree on that shit. But it's like you being a fucking bitch. I don't working. know. I think that when your like platform is big enough, you're gonna, you're bound to have annoying people that like your shit. Not us. All no. of our fans. Are all of our so fans. Cool. All of our fans are big. Not dick weird. Warriors. Liam's Liam's <laughs> a cool guy who doesn't harass every woman. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah random it. people we follow. Yeah, my girlfriend. That. He's yeah. been DMing people that, that just. Oh yeah, yeah. Me and some, Nick follow. Some guy DMing. He's like, tell Liam to stop <laughs> DMing my girlfriend. Weird ass <laughs> shit. <laughs> Uh, Liam, continue doing <laughs> no, it. No, Liam, don't do it. No, Liam, keep Liam. doing it. Unfortunately, <laughs> Nick, Liam, Liam, Nick, Nick is like his You're his deity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, well, I encourage this behavior. I think it's, it's funny to me. In it Liam, might inconvenience me personally, but boy, if it ain't funny. <laughs> In Liam's like unfinished garage where he sleeps, he definitely has like a Nick shrine. <laughs> no, there's nothing in there. Yeah, I know. It's I saw the video. Yeah. <laughs> Liam, stop fucking emailing people's girlfriends. <laughs> Put <her> DMing. <laughs> Please. I feel like he's our son at this point. He is basically. He's like our, our badly behaved son, and we have to like every episode give him. And if we ever see him, we're gonna molest him. Of course. Well, he's <laughs> teach him a lesson for his we bad to, behavior. We, we gotta re- we gotta sex him into the crew. <laughs> we gotta right? sex him in. <laughs> Everyone gets sexed in. All the <laughs> fellas get sexed into the crew. Yeah, you can't join our gang unless you're getting sexed in. <laughs> Oh, you remember that Immortal Technique song, Dance with where the he's Devil? Like rape, he, it ends up he rapes his mom. Yeah, where where he he the like end of that thread is people saying that Come Town sucks. Which <laughs> 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 is perfect. Oh, just you wait, boys. Yeah. Uh, no, no, uh, that's like, I'm happy, because I, honestly, I do feel, I mean, I'm like, we're friends with the Chapo guys, yeah. and I don't, there like, are, yeah, there I don't want to make it seem like I'm shitting on Chapo and no. not just Their show one, is good, and they're really this smart. one pat- yeah. particular person that's, you know, Filling their very lonely diaper over, yeah. you know, hearing the word virgin. So I'm glad that that thread ends with people shitting on our show. Yes. Because cool. it kind of balances everything out. A little yin yang. Yin yang, you know? Mm-hmm. The yin yang. Oh, twins. Yo, yo, I call <laughs> it's me, yin yang. <laughs> That's a character, right? That's a yeah, good yeah. <laughs> Where's that tape? Dasha, bring the tape in here. <laughs> did, did Asian people, like, did, like, those, like, slam poet Asian kind of Twitter SJW people, I guess they weren't around, but they could have gotten mad at the yin yang twins for mm, yeah, yeah. Yeah. appropriation, no? Mm, yes. Imagine the yin yang twins with their Asians, and they're like, wait, he's <laughs> but it's for a different reason. <laughs> hey girl, where do you see my dick? 
Boom, boom, boom. That song's so good. Hey, little girl, let me wish you a meal. Hey, little girl. I got a tiny ass dick. I got a tiny ass dick, and I am from China. And I am from China. You will never get enough because it's physically impossible to. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, so good. Hiya. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, that was a good. That was a banger too, though. That song fucking ruled, dude. Yeah. I love that song. Those guys rocked. Mm-hmm. Were they the ones? Do you remember th- their MTV cribs? Yeah, it was yeah. like clearly just a furnished apartment that they rented, <laughs> yeah, yeah, and they yeah. were like trying to explain the stuff on the walls. So they had, like rooms that they'd never see. They're like, yeah, we got like boat stuff in yeah, this room. Yeah. <laughs> they like didn't understand. Who had an awesome MTV cribs? It was just like a shitty house. Red Man. Red Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Red Man's house. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's like the doorbell doesn't work. You got to rub the two, yeah. <laughs> two wires he's together. Like, this is a studio. This is where magic happens. It's just like a cast. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> he just had like a fucking a sound system from Sears, like those like. Dude, I love speakers. Red Man. Yeah, I loved movie. How High when I was a kid. That was like my favorite movie. That was a good movie, bro. Why do you see my dick? <sighs> well, a lot of dead air on this episode. Yeah, a lot of googling happening. A lot of googling. A lot of just. It, hanging it, out. I feel like a lot of dead air, but still not a particularly bad one. I think it was a good one thanks to this guy who doesn't fuck. <laughs> for doing his also, we want to say of the we episode. do want to say thank you to that guy because yeah. you really did inspire us Literally. this morning. Yeah, yeah. Um, we mail him something. No, yeah, we should suck his dick. Yeah, we'll go. Adam we should, will come. Adam, Adam will give you. Your cock. Adam will give up the boy pussy for you, my friend. I'll do that yeah. for you. Well, mm-hmm. people are already offering that. That's what I love about. That's that. cool. That is the weirdest part. You can of come that fuck my it's gay like, ass. <laughs> 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 if you want to come to Calgary, you can fuck my. Hey, yeah. comrade, come fuck my ass, yeah. comrade. Um. Yeah. Well, I guess. Let's see. We probably have people like. Can't fuck that listen to our show, but yeah, but listen, don't be like yeah, Liam. Hang Liam in there, guys. Fuck. Yeah, Liam yeah. can't fuck. Improve things about yourself. Our, our make can't, yourself our can't fuck people who have the right answer, which is getting really into Rubik's cubes and weight <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Eventually, no, you'll trick a girl with a logic puzzle. Uh, yeah, yeah, puzzle yeah. into fucking right, right, right. Yeah, <laughs> toys from the Discovery <laughs> <Yeah>. Store. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Yeah, I'm gonna get really into poi and devil sticks. That's all attract women. <laughs> By being really good at magic eight ball, <laughs> I just feel yeah. like. Do you have to fuck me? <laughs> yeah. It probably is easier to fuck in New York than it is to fuck like in a place where yeah, there's like three eligible women. Of course it is. Yeah. You could. Fuck. Yeah, if you're in some small town where you're the guy. That, that, that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but like, just I don't know. Move to, move to the biggest city in your right, little dude. fucked up place. Take, make a little trip over to Chinatown. Mm-hmm. Find exactly. Any, any, ask for any the, one of those. Ask women. for the Friedland special. Yeah. yeah, it's literally thirty five dollars. Just follow a Chinese woman into her apartment. <laughs> no, it was more. <laughs> How much did you pay for that? Because thirty five dollars just covers the massage. That's the massage. Yeah, and, and then, then I immediately could tell that it was a special place because the massage was terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, uh, and then I think it was like maybe a hundred dollars. Nice. She yeah, was very I, nice. I went with a girl to go get massages. It was a place I'd been to before, and we were in like stalls next to each other. Mm-hmm. Was, I mean, they're just like like a curtain or whatever. Yeah, yeah. And so, like, I'm getting a massage, and then I hear her getting a massage, and I just hear like is she getting jacked up, <laughs> like farting noises. Oh, and I'm yeah. like, whatever, you know, to relax. Or, and then afterwards, we were like leaving, and she was like, "Did you hear that?" And I'm like. Yeah, that's like normal or whatever. She was like, no, that guy kept farting. <laughs> it was like the guy doing the massage. <laughs> just like farting while, like, thinking that he could be like, yeah, it's you. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> <laughs> just blame it on the client. Fuck <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. Damn, I want to get a massage. Um, yeah, there's, I guess there's, where, where, which place did you go to? You went in Chinatown? Yeah, I just go to whatever. There's mm-hmm. there's one where I hear this, this is pretty good that isn't a hand job place where they, where it's like, you know, $45 or something. Okay. I'm not opposed to really really hand really hand where is that? Like where was the hand job place you went? Canal? It was on Canal, yeah. Mm-hmm. And you yeah. knew it was a hand job place? I did not know it was, it was a hand job place. That to but happen. I have absolutely no 
shame about <laughs> my experience there. Yeah. Good no, for you, man. I'm not one of those Puritan. Purit- Do they blow you? They just jack you off with a condom on. No, she just gave me. She said she just gave me a hand. She just said, uh, Did okay. They put a condom on. No, she just, just gave me a hand. You off to yeah, yeah. On? And I, I, and it was, it was really good. <laughs> it was, Sounds pretty good. Yeah, yeah. it was really nice. <clears throat> and honestly, if she's gonna like, off. if she's gonna spend half an hour and get forty five dollars, if she's gonna spend half an hour and get one hundred and forty five dollars, and all she has you're, to do, you're is, a comrade. Yeah, she's a she's worker, a worker. Yep. right? Mm-hmm. And I'm trying to organize. <laughs> That's right. That's, That's what I am. I'm a salter. Mm-hmm. I'm a guy that I have to get enough hand jobs. A sexual different. assaulter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Out of the mouth of the Jay Bird himself. <laughs> I read a I read a blind item on <laughs> Crazy, Night of the Crazy Days and Nights about a director who uh, cannot stop getting. Uh, happy I'm going to submit blind items about you. This permanent <laughs> D-list podcast yeah, yeah. has alluded to a fact that having a hand in, <laughs> in certain Asian interests. A lot of a lot of people go all the time to those places. Like mm-hmm. I, I can imagine that could be addicting. Yeah. But oh, you can imagine. Oh, you can imagine. Huh? Honestly, if the massage was better. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I want, man. I fucked up my back. Yeah. Um, and like. It just like, you know, how, I mean, back pain is like the fucking worst. It just yeah, comes out of nowhere, and then you're just locked. And I, I did real last podcast, and I couldn't move. Mm-hmm. And then I got out, and I went to Chinatown, and got a massage, and I was like, just jam your fucking elbow in there. And the lady spent 30 minutes, like, putting all of her weight into Did it fix back. it? It felt amazing. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. And I was like, fuck, I should go get <clears throat> massages. And then, but if you mm-hmm. go and you don't have back pain, it's kind of just whatever. It doesn't yeah, do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It loosens you up. It no, it doesn't. I, just, I, I feel zero difference. I, like, I have to go when I already have that. You don't feel relaxed at all? No. Yeah. Um, all right, well, let's wrap this up. We, we should do a say. spa day. <coughs> I'll go to the spa. Oh. What, what were we saying we were going to do? I feel like we were talking about doing a fun activity. We were going to have a cookout go to today, but it's oh, raining. It's fucking raining. Yeah, we should go to Luger's. We should go to Luger's sometime. Get a reservation. <coughs> yeah. I think we'll you got to get one. I got to save up for that Frank Frazetta pan. Oh, so you can't get steak with us? Yeah. <laughs> I need, right, need $1.7 million. <laughs> well, if we do the podcast for what, like 10 more years? 100 years or something, yeah. I wish I could paint like Frank. I would do the, I would do the, like, this fantasy art with stuff like that. Hell yeah. Just a dragon with breasts. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I love that shit. And his is actually good. Everyone is basically just a shittier version of him since yeah. then. Yeah. His, his is, is like legitimately good painting. Yeah. It just yeah, happens yeah. to be this badass shit out of it. Um, all right. <coughs> well, we got Funny Moms tomorrow. What is it, Memorial Day? It's going to, yeah, Memorial Day. Funny Moms is tomorrow night. We'll the be 28th. posting about it today and tomorrow. We got, uh, who's on I it? I booked a couple people. Brett Davis Brett is Davis, doing it. Justin Flanagan. Justin Flanagan, nice. Um, <coughs> I think I booked somebody else. We might book a couple more people. Um, okay. But yeah, some good, that'll be really good. Come out to that, motherfuckers. And then I am going to be in Seattle in <coughs> Thursday, the 28th at last, Comedy Club. Um, so please come out to that. The tickets are already live. I'm going to be posting about it more soon. The tickets are free. The tickets are free. When are you there in <laughs> August? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, and then I'm also going to be in Portland. We still haven't figured out the date, but it's going to either be... Maybe August 22nd, baby. July come 1st, on out. 2nd, or 3rd, I think. Yeah. Where July you 13th. Yeah, oh, yeah, you're just saying... You should you should uh, make that show free because those, those people don't spend money. In yeah. Portland? Yeah, they're all freakins. Yeah, they all live at home and don't have sex. Yeah, well, they if, you're, if you're in South But for come, good reasons, for come, socialist reasons. Come yeah. to Portland and I'll suck you off. Not because come of the right show. wing. They yeah. eat out of the dumpster behind Trader Joe's. Nice. <laughs> those guys. Um, so anyway, yeah, and um, well, I'm coming out to both those cities, so if you have anything, think there's shit I should do and hang out. My friend George is working there, so it's going to be a little bros week I'm going to do up there, so... Come out, and then we also have, uh, we're doing Auto Bar the 12th, right? Of August. Of August. Yeah. And then the Cleveland-Boston tour. And then we're on Cleveland-Boston <laughs> tour. This is uh, sometime in September, first weekend in September, I think. And then hopefully more dates in the fall and winter. Yeah, we're working on it, baby. Um, yeah, thanks for listening. And thank you to that guy for writing that Reddit post. And R.I.P. Dylan. R.I.P. Dylan, baby. Yeah, yeah. R.I.P. Dylan Meyer. Final shit word. sucks, dude. Yeah. It sucks. Um, the, and, world, uh, the world is fucking Ha, 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 Donnie. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm gonna just re say R. I. P. Dylan <laughs> is the last word. Yeah. Don't make fun of Donnie. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Donnie's a good sport. Yeah, Donnie, but he also he's just fucking traumatized one of the worst yesterday. days of his life. Probably was wa- finding his. I dead know, friend. but that's one of those things we're all gonna look back at and laugh. And laugh. Yeah, but, and sure. by me, I mean by look back at it in 30 seconds after <laughs> I found out <laughs> the scenario in which that. I was so upset at you when you were saying that. <laughs> yeah, I was like so. Because uh, I was, was like, like an in an awful maybe. movie. I was in a yeah. terrible movie. And then you, you text me about what happened, and then Nick's like, <laughs> ready to rip, baby. Ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> it is an illness he has. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Don't see that Don't see that lesbian Orthodox Jewish woman movie. It's not, you can't jack off to it. Josh and I yeah. love it. Oh, boo. Whatever. You um, got to have a sense of humor about these things, right? Yeah. That's right. <laughs> um, all right. That's what it's going to say on your tombstone. You got to laugh. Oh, I'm you never going to die. And certainly not in a funny way that people make fun of. <laughs> 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 All right. Goodbye, guys. Bye. Later.